Hello everyone, and welcome back to Dude Can Cook. Today, we're going to be making a meal that I make every week, and also an extra side dish. So, I just put my big pot on high heat, and now I'm going to chop up my tofu cubes. Then I will turn off the heat and add some olive oil to cover the bottom of the pan. And then we'll add the tofu. And we can turn the heat on high again. And the next step, I'm just going to put in some rice into my little pot over there. I'm using, uh, I think it's probably about half a cup of dry rice in there. And then about a cup of water. And we put on medium heat and add a tablespoon of butter. And then the lid. And we can gently stir the tofu. I'm pushing from one side to the other to minimize breakage. And next up we're going to wash and chop up our bok choy for our side dish later. So I chopped them up into like two to three inch pieces here. And then I'm going to put those on a plate and add some salt and pepper to them, and then we can just set aside the bok choy. Then I'm just turning down the heat on the rice to low, now that it's simmering, and then we can start working on the garlic. We're just going to peel and mince up two cloves of garlic, And I ended up cutting myself, amazingly. I cannot remember the last time I cut myself cooking, but a uh, long time ago. Alright, and then next up we're going to be working on the bell peppers. So just cut off the tops and all the insides. And wash them out. Drying the tofu again. And next up we've got an onion. So just gonna remove the stem end, cut them in half, and peel them. And more tofu stirring, and the rice is also done. And now we're just going to dice up the onions. And all done. So now the tofu should be done. And we can turn off the heat and start adding in our spices. So I'm using black pepper and some garlic powder, some cayenne, and some cumin, and then the fresh garlic that we minced earlier. Stir it all up. Make sure the tofu is nicely coated, and then we can remove the tofu from the pan and try to get out all the minced garlic as well while leaving the uh, oil in the pan so that we can use the oil to cook up the veggies. So we add the onions into the pan, and then we're just going to chop up our peppers, because we haven't done that yet. So I'm just going to dice them roughly. And then we can turn on the heat on the onions and start stirring those up and sauteing them a bit and just cook them until you can smell the onion smell coming off of it strongly, and then go ahead and add the peppers 
and do the same thing. Just cook until they're fragrant. And then we can turn off the heat and add the tofu and garlic back into the pan and mix it up a bit. And now we have the sauce, so I'm going to add a little light soy sauce, some hot sauce, some black bean chili sauce, some mirin, some ketchup lettuce, some dark soy sauce, some sesame oil, and don't use too much of any of the soy sauces because we don't want it to be too salty, okay? And then some MSG as well. And stir it all up. Then we can add the rice in and mix that up and the sauce will get all thickened from the starch of the rice and then we can go ahead and set that aside. And there that is. That's our main dish complete. And now we're going to make the sautéed bok choy. So turn the heat back on and let the pan heat up a bit and then add the bok choy and just start stirring. And you're going to keep stirring for a while. And still stirring. And eventually the leaves will be a little bit wilted and everything and you can remove it from the pan. And that's done. So now I'm just going to wash my pot and now we can plate. So I'm just going to take a nice big portion of the main dish and the bok choy and put them on there. All the bok choy, that was just one portion. And also try putting some lemon juice on top of all of that because that's really delicious. Okay, that's it for today. Bye bye.